my name is Sarah and I'm a horticulturist for Smithsonian Gardens and today I'm going to give you a quick tour of the gardens around the National Air and Space Museum here in Washington DC. So we're going to start our tour today on the north side of the building so it's right off of the National Mall and this is our flight garden. So this garden is part of our habitat exhibition which is a campus-wide exhibition we have here for Smithsonian Gardens. And this exhibit talks about all of the ways that nature has inspired the invention of flight. So it looks at things like how birds fly and how that's inspired flight, even down to the little helicopter seeds off of maple trees. Several parts of our garden here are in pretty deep shade from a mature tree collection that we have. So if you're looking for some inspiration on shade gardening, look no further. We have everything from hostas to ferns, um, we have uh, hydrangeas and hellebores, everything to get you started on creating your own shade garden at home. Now we're on the east side of our building. Some of you may not know this, but the west side of our building is currently under construction. So we'll only be touring half of the building today, but what we have open is looking beautiful and we're gonna go check out more. Our gardens here also include several annual displays and we use those as a way to greet visitors and have some bright cheerful color all season long as people are walking or driving past. The east side of our building is largely what we call our meadow garden. So this side of the garden has this huge mix of perennials and the idea is that all of these perennials will help to support our pollinators. So we have things like mountain mint, which you see here. Um, we have rudbeckia, we have all kinds of things to help our, all of our bees and butterfly friends to find a place to get food and rest up and recharge. Now we're on the north side of the building and we're gonna walk down Independence Avenue and check out our tropical bed. The last stop on our tour is our tropical bed. So this bed has some plants that you might not be used to seeing north of the Carolinas and those are hardy tropical plants. So we actually have a whole collection of bananas and we actually have three different kinds of palms. 
We have a specimen windmill palm, we have needle palms, and we have sable palms. And what's great is that all of these plants are hardy for us here and we don't have to do any special treatment for them and they come back for us every year. Thanks for joining me on this tour today. I hope you enjoyed looking at our gardens. And, I, and now the Smithsonian Gardens is open. I hope you'll actually come check out the gardens for yourself in person. And before you do, don't forget to check out our website for a full list of details on how to visit safely. Have a great day.